Hello everybody, how you all doing? It's Colin Verley from All7 TV, I hope you're doing great. Um, today we're going to be reviewing the Aston Villa third shirt and the goalkeeping one as well, because as you know, uh, we've got both of them here and we're going to be reviewing them today because, you know, I just feel like I haven't done a video on this channel for a bit. It's been, it's been a little bit, hasn't it? So, um, right, so moving on to the first one here. It is the it is the white one as you can see, and I'll move this out of the way just so you can get a better view. This is the elite one, so it's really um it's really like um tight fitted as you can see. Uh, I quite I quite like this to be fair. I like the little rubber little rubber logo there, and on the on this one you can see that there is um if I can find it, you can see that um there's a different material on this one, so that's pretty cool. Um, <laughs> I wasn't supposed to get the tight fitted one, it was a mistake, but you know, I got one in the end, it was 90 quid, and I actually quite like it. I like the material they've used. This is actually a map of Birmingham, as you can see. So, we've got like all the all the parts of Birmingham, you know, and all this, that, and the other. I'm not going to go into far detail of the the, uh, the places in Birmingham because my geography isn't that good, <laughs> so you know, but yeah, I did think this was camouflage, but it's not, it's actually a map. Um, the colours are a little bit weird, okay, the colours are a little bit strange, I would have preferred it if, if I had it the same colour as that collar, maybe, in, in like a light green kind of thing, that'd be quite nice, but the keeper one's really, really nice, I kind of prefer the keeper one to this one, to be honest, um, the collar's kind of nice, it has a nice little uh, neon green effect there and a little bit of a dark blue down there, um, yeah, I, I quite like this, um, the back is pretty pretty standard, so I'm not going to show you the back, it's got nothing on it, no player name or this, that and the other, um, the badge is rubberized as well, which is something that they, they put in, because the badges were all wonky and this, that and the other, so, that's pretty cool, which is also rubberized on that one, by the way, the actual one before, so, yeah, yeah, let's get into the, um, keeping top then now, let's move this over here, uh, right, this one is really, really nice, I love this one, look at that, it kind of looks like, um, a blue shirt, to be honest, and I think I think blues would have done a lot better having this one, just because they're Birmingham City and it's the map of Birmingham, as you as you know. But you know, I quite, I quite like this one, man. I quite like this one. Um, it's it's a nice colour, and the colours the colour's quite nice as well. I like how they've done the the same as same as that, but in reverse colours as well. So that's pretty cool. Um, yeah, it's the same principles again. It's still the map of Birmingham, but a different colour. Um, not really much to say. I like how they've done the badge there. And to be honest, um, I think they should have done the badge on the away kit, the same colours as the as the away kit as they've done on these shirts. So that, these are pretty nice. The first time I saw this, I was like, "Is that a training top?" But I realised it was the keeper one. I never even saw it on the website. So that was pretty cool. Um, yeah. And oh, actually, there is something on the back. I love these little light green effects down the down the back there, they're pretty cool as well, and I'll tell you what I'll do, I'll turn this one over so you can see on the back too, it's the same colour, and yeah, it's really nice, we actually worn that um, against Bristol City on, on Thursday, and Troy Allray scored an absolute belter of a goal, didn't they, and uh, yeah, Jacob Ramsey did fantastically well in that game, with that amazing one, and that great, uh, lovely chip pass to Troy Allray. and by the time I'm recording this, we're linked with Cyprien, Loftus Cheek and Ross Barkley. So I don't know what the fuck's going on. We've had so many midfielders. It's unbelievable that we're linked with. <laughs> so yeah, thanks so much for watching, guys. Up the villa and take care. See you later, guys.